Have you ever imported your Unreal Engine renders into Premiere Pro only to find them way darker than they should be? You're not alone. And if you're looking for an ACES 1.3 workflow inside Premiere Pro, unfortunately, it's just not natively supported. But don't worry, I've got a fix for you. Unlike DaVinci Resolve or Nuke, Premiere Pro doesn't have native ACES support. No ACES 1.3, no color managed pipeline, nothing. Which means Unreal Engine renders using ACES SCG look way darker when you bring them in. After researching for three days, I found two methods to fix this issue. Let's start with the first one. Now, I'll jump into my Unreal Engine project. If you were using my render settings, we just need to make a slight change in the color output settings. Once that's done, I'll start rendering this scene. Go to Color Output, open Color I.O. Configuration and add desired color space, this time ACES CCT. Save and close it, and now change Transform Destination from ACES CG to ACES CCT, and now you can start your rendering. If you want a full guide on render settings, I've got you covered. I'll link my complete render settings guide video in the description below. All right, now that the render is finished, let's jump into Premiere Pro and import our footage. I'll name my project Tutorial, then click on Import Media. Now, I'll select the first frame of our render. Make sure Image Sequence is checked in the Media Browser and click Open. After dragging the footage onto the timeline, you'll notice that the colors look different from our original scene. To fix this, we'll use a plugin called Look Designer. Just go to the Effects panel, search for Look Designer, and drag and drop it onto our footage. Now, inside the Effect Controls panel, we need to select the Input Profile. Since this plugin has limited input profiles, we had to choose ACES CCT as our transform destination. The plugin also supports a wide range of professional cameras, making it a really useful tool for creators. You can see that our scene now looks exactly like it does in the Unreal Engine viewport. But what if you don't want to spend money on this plugin? Don't worry, I've got you covered. If you used my render settings with ACES CG as the color output, just import your footage, drag and drop the footage onto the timeline, then import the preset I created for ACES CG in Premiere Pro to fix the darker render from Unreal Engine. Just drag and drop this preset onto your footage and it'll be instantly fixed. So here's what I did. I made a Lumetri color preset that instantly fixes the dark render issue. No weird hacks, no guesswork. Just drop it on your footage and boom, your colors are back. This preset properly adjusts the gamma and exposure to match how your render should look in an ACES workflow. And best of all, it works instantly. If you want to grab this preset, check the link in the description. Let me know in the comments if you found this helpful. See you in the next one.